hey guys before we start um don't forget to uh, leave a like subscribe and click that bell it's easy simple free and it takes less than 10 seconds now let's start what's going on guys it's master bricks here and today i'm going to be doing a showcase of my three planes now this plane and this plane aren't based off of anything but this plane is based off a set with uh, two jets and a um biplane i don't know what set that is but anyways let's get on to the functions and functions and features the plane is actually a jet it's a f-18 hornet or at least that's what it is based on and it hasn't got many functions or features it only has these y-wing um wings which is pretty cool and we have the landing gear and a small uh, rocket we have the air intakes and we have the uh front the seat that's the place where mini finger would normally sit in but um I'll try get one in there um, later, or maybe or not. Uh, but this is a bubble canopy. Um, I couldn't find any more canopies. Now the features of this is that there's a grey base made from a boat piece. There's a white stripe. It doesn't continue all the way, but then there's a big red stripe that does continue. And then there's a big um, grey um, stripe. It goes from the end and it connects to the bottom, which may actually makes it look like it actually connects, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, that should be it. But it has two afterburners. Um, I don't know what they are for. It's probably for taking off. We have this very uh, long and like kind of jagged nose because if you see there, the connector probably one by one by one brick high. Um, cone it isn't exactly smooth and we have a, a small um, like kind of cross um, thing at the end with a bar it goes through these two parts that's what connects them together and okay and anyways let's get on to the second plane second plane here is a stunt plane but with no bubble canopy or any like canopy at all it, but it does have this cool v um for engine with an engine block which is cool it has these black wings they are they are solid they are not they're all one piece not connecting them though because that's where the driver would normally sit it has some beautiful colors it has this custom made uh, two uh, prop propeller um has very smooth edges and no no some are smooth like the this part and this part there's a grill piece right here some smooth tiles i might tile that up but as we get to the back you see you have these sort of um winglet things um they help steer the plane i couldn't put it on there because this surface is is not good at connecting these are not lego um but please don't discriminate. Um, I don't have much Lego wings, but these are Lego wings at the back. I use two um, four by one by three hot three bricks high that go slightly. It's actually probably a five by one because it goes back all the way here, one stud behind, kind of like wing pieces. Same the same ones that I used on here, but they are white, and for some reason I did half white half black but i put the black inside we have a small light here and of course these two wing look things control like like whether it's going left or right side on the underside it has a lot of plate a lot of plates we have a small another one of these that's you that is still used on this here right here as you can see right here and um, that kind of smooths it out. We have some like normal Lego City wheels. We have some smaller wheels that are from like back then when the um, standard um, 
width was four studs instead of six studs now it's six studs and i have kept to that mostly six studs wide mm, the propeller is actually like that's seven studs long eight nine so it's nine studs wide but the wings are a bit more so i'll have to take these separate these two separate wings don't take them off that you can just fold them onto here not fully you can only fold them like up to here and down to here that's a that's kind of a lot of movement you have to take this wing off have to have to take these like things off i mean not wings but they're like the back of the plane the actual like wing that goes up from the back i'll have to take these wings off i'll have to take this propeller off and uh and probably the wheels anyways that's it let's go on to the last plane last plane i'm trying to like account for like the world war ii style where the wings were actually the wrong way round. they were actually swapped and this plane has two propellers has a lot more features and at the back you cut this is a bigger wing um than the other planes it only has one though with a uh, rear like rudder that can make it steer left and right sorry left and right um and it has the same um winglets as the um stunt plane did um but this has more of a curve like flat surface but this is more a lot more chunky um and you'll see the for some reason i use the smaller wheels these wheels don't fold in whereas these ones they do this is special for this one i thought it would be cool so it actually looks flat like that i uh, won't be covering up the wheels because because then i'll have to use do like a 10 step process because if i like like use like the fault um some um pieces that I use like for these like to make it um go up and down I'll have to have a lot of those or I'll have to have a bigger undercarriage to like like fold it up and like fold out but I like it just the way it is um I wish I could ha have the have these pieces in black they are Technic pieces I have some small wheels um and uh two and of course um World War II style um two three prop propellers to them we have this front um which is kind of weird these have we have these two like filler caps we have a uh, space for like maybe one yeah one mini finger i couldn't find another canopy for this so i just use the lego uh, things that they use for the lego city um cars just one of them not two of them because normally in world war ii they would be open for some reason i don't know why but sadly this does not come with um any bombs or anything so yeah that should be it for today's um showcase anyways i hope you enjoyed don't forget to like and subscribe and click that bell it's easy it's simple and it shows me you want to see more mock showcases and more builds and more reviews hopefully i will come up with them Anyways, signing off for now. Bye!